Darling Farms' Jaime Gomez and Ernesto Solis J Fire Up, who set a track record last year for earnings by a filly during a single season at Los Alamitos Racecourse, was named the 2017 Pacific Coast Quarter Horse Racing Association Horse of the Year at the annual awards banquet on Thursday night. Bred and trained by Jaime Gomez, the California bred filly by Kitty Up was also named PCQHRA champion two-year-old filly. J Fire Up finished her brilliant season with seven wins and nine starts, and earnings of over $1.4 million. Out of the mare, this boogie fires, J Fire Up won the Grade 1 Los Alamitos 2 million Futurity, the Grade 1 Golden State Million Futurity, and the Restricted Grade 3 Governor's Cup Futurity. She was $6,354 shy of the all-time single season market earnings set by the then two-year-old gelding trespasses in 2008. Enrique Gonzalez of EG High Desert Farms received the Frank Vessel Senior Memorial Award in recognition for outstanding contributions to the sport of quarter horse racing. EG High Desert Farms is annually among the nation's leading owners and has been a force at Los Alamitos for nearly two decades. Gonzalez, who has served on the PCQHRA Board of Directors, is also among the top consigners each year at the Los Alamitos Equine Sale. In one of the moments of the night, the PCQHRA posthumously awarded Brad McKenzie with the Sam Thompson Award, which is presented to an individual who displays leadership within the Los Alamitos racing community. McKenzie will forever be remembered at Los Alamitos Racecourse for his many important contributions to the sport. He was co-founder of the Finish Line Self-Insurance Group, and one of the driving forces in bringing daytime Southern California thoroughbred racing back to Los Alamitos Racecourse. Ed Allred was named the Owner of the Year and Breeder of the Year. He finished as the leading owner in terms of wins, while racing homebred stakes winners, He Looks Hot, Tustin Kid, and Bound to Bed. Paul Jones was recognized as the Trainer of the Year after leading the meet in quarter horse wins while also campaigning graded stakes winners Just Good Reason, KV and Corona, and Dad Rico. Jaime Gomez received a Special Achievement Trainer Award for his great work with the champion J Fire Up and major stakes winners Kazak and Mooney Blues. Gomez was also awarded the Trophy for Breeder Special Achievement Award for J Fire Up. Jesus Rios Ayala was the Jockey of the Year after winning his first quarter horse riding title while Jose Nicasio won the Jockey Special Achievement Award after piloting J-Fire up to a record-breaking campaign. The 21-year-old pilot was also recognized with the Val Tonks Award given to an up-and-coming quarter horse rider. The Owner Special Achievement Award went to Reliance Ranches. Owned by Keith Nellison, KVN Corona was the top two-year-old colt after enjoying a perfect juvenile campaign. The colt by Corona Cartel won all six of his starts, including two Futurity Finals. Gray One finalist Chance to Fire was named the top two-year-old gelding. The aforementioned Kazak and Dad Rico were named co-champion three-year-old geldings. Kitty Up Cowgirl was named the three-year-old filly, while Stelfast was named the three-year-old colt. In the Older Horses Award, Jose Flores and Ron and Denise Van Amberg's Champion of Champions winner, Mr. PYC2U, was named the top age stallion. Just Good Reason, who raced for John and Sheena Sperry, was named top age mare while Bill Hober's B.H. Lisa's Boy was named the Top H Gelding. Other equine awards included Who's Coos as the Most Improved Horse and Dad Rico as the Moonest Award winner for his season-long success and longevity for a stakes or allowance horse. PCQHRA presented Remember Me Rose with the James V.A. Carter Award for Outstanding Broodmare. The mare is the mother of three grade one futurity finalists in 2017. Kitty Up was the sire of the year, winning the Three Bars Award. Awards for the top thoroughbred horsemen were given to owners C.D. Ranch, trainer Jesus Nunez, and jockeys Vinnie Bednar and Juan Sanchez. Awards to leading quarter horse horsemen in the Northern California Fairs were also presented, as were awards for leading money-winning calbrits in nine different divisions.